I got to leave you now. But there is good news in the text. The Bible says that if you stick with God, if you stay with God, if you trust in God in spite of your trials, God will guide you <laughs> to ultimate triumph. It's right here in the text. The Bible says that he will. Lord, have mercy. Did y'all hear that? He will. That is a definitive clause. That's a definite clause that he will direct your path. The word path in the text means road, journey, uh, uh, path. These are places we walk and travel towards. In other words, all of your journeys, wherever we go, every decision and direction we take, God will be with us. The Lord never promised us that life would be easy, but he did promise to direct our path. Can I get a witness here? And can I shout to you this morning, if God promised to direct our path, that means that he promised to be with us every step of the way. God will lead us to a place of safety. That's the beauty of our covenant relationship with God. Ah, trusting God even when you don't understand. Trusting is the key, my brothers and sisters, to continuation. You see, because when I don't trust, I stop. And when I cease trusting, I cease moving. And when I cease moving, I'm no longer active. And when I'm no longer active, eventually I die. But trusting ensures continuation. Can I get a witness here? Trusting my brothers and sisters plugs us into the ableness of God. I've discovered that a light bulb has no power without a connection to a power source. A sailboat, Reggie, can go nowhere without the power of the wind. A stack of wood in a fireplace warms nobody without the power of a flame. And a child of God who does not trust in his God walks in limited power. You ought to look at your neighbor and say, neighbor, plug in. Or you ought to say it like you mean and say, neighbor, plug in. You ought to just tell yourself, plug in. Because when you trust in God, you are plugging in. So trust God today and see if there's not a power surge in your soul. Plug in and watch God work in your life. If you plug in, he'll step in. If you plug in, he'll speak to your mind. If you plug in, he'll tell you which way to go. If you plug in, he'll be your healer. If you plug in, he will guide you to that job or to that career. I said, if you plug in, he will direct your path. If you plug in, watch God direct your path because we cannot experience his ableness if we are living in an era of self-rule. But when we cease trusting in ourselves and place our confidence in him, we can experience his power and his ableness. Won't he do it? I said, won't he do it? I said, won't he do it? Somebody ought to shout, he is able. Able to do whatever you need him to do. Amen? Amen. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not to your own understanding, but in all your ways acknowledge him and he will direct your path. Amen? Amen. And amen.